So the innovation of Shift, it's a real game changer. It's an ability that you've never seen before in a video game. It totally, totally changes the way you play a driving game. Shift's an ability that Tanner gains at the beginning of the game, and it's completely interwoven into the storyline. I could sort of pick a body, and wham, I'm inside them. Man, finish your damn donut, then I'm taking you to a shrink. It gives the player the ability to manipulate traffic and to, uh, to play with things, like a kid playing with, uh, with toy cars. And this is the kind of thing that we reward in the game with these, um, these dares that allow the player to, to challenge themselves. They're a little bit like side missions, but they're important in the, uh, in the progression. These can be anything like uh, jump 20 meters to uh, achieve a certain speed or a certain length of drift and all sorts of other simple challenges as well. So as you play through the game and achieve your objectives, you increase your willpower. Willpower is the sort of currency of the game, so the shift ability isn't, isn't free. The shift ability is earned by cool driving. Once you watch people actually play it, it is a transforming experience for them because it totally frees you up to do almost whatever you want. So you might just see a car chase go past you, and that's when you use shift. You use shift into that action, and it will cause a huge accident behind you. And of course, then you get away from the cops and the road's blocked and away you go. It really is that much fun. It's a, a totally unique experience. All the time you're thinking about how you can strategically adjust uh, what's happening in front of you. Throughout the game, it actually upgrades as Tanner becomes stronger. First thing is that uh, the shift itself becomes more powerful, so we can pull further up and see more of the city, more of the cars. That changes the kind of mission we can do with shift. So we can create situations where you have to, to move very fast in different spaces to settle problems. On street level, one basic situation is you have a getaway car, is in a very fast car, you're in a not so good cop car. This is dispatch. We have a 207 in progress near City Hall. You need to, to catch him. So you would use shift either to take another car, which is faster, to, to get him, or take something in oncoming traffic and blow it into, into your target car. The game is completely designed around shift. So it's not like a cheat. It's not like it's a, an unlimited ability. It's actually uh, integral to the gameplay. One of the first upgrades that, uh, that we have is what we call rapid shift. So if you're two cops in a cop chase trying to take down a getaway car, one push of a button and you can rapidly shift between those two cop cars. We have boost, which is like a nitrous uh, type of thing. We have ram. Ram ability is like a punch. You can just swap cars and just always be at the heart of the action. Shift out, shift in, shift out, shift in. It's faster, it's quicker. You can be in one car and then a fraction of a second you're in a car that's a few hundred yards up the road. It transforms your perception of what a driving game can be. As soon as people get their hands on it, they just get it and they love it.